Anybody else? Anyone else? Cool. Yeah. Oh, um, what I use it for, I don't ever use it for P and J at the same time. So I use the P pickup for more upright or more aggressive, more fat sound. I love the rear pickup for a lot more gainy stuff or if I'm doing, you guys will hear when I get over to the modulation area, it makes the pedal react differently. Like what you throw into a pedal will make that pedal react completely different, obviously. So. If you throw a lot of low end into a pedal, sometimes certain pedals don't handle low end well, they don't have the headroom. Sometimes they actually just love it, like fuzzes do. So I'll use fuzzes with this, but distortions, the rear pickup, because it really drives that, that distortion circuit, and it's really cool for aggressive sound, pick sound, and then, but with modulation, like when you hit chorus, like the chorus with high end, just man, it's just so much more color than with the low end. It's just, low end is way more, texture but with high with, with the rear pickups a lot more high end so it's more music like it's just you guys will hear when I get to the chorus or any of the modulation levels but um cool and then anyway anybody know what I'm saying I keep saying modulation does anybody not know what that means because that is another one that it took me a while to understand I was like I don't get it modulation and so yeah oh you want to know okay so um the easy like modulating the key so like uh, everybody know Bon Jovi is? Does everybody, you guys, come on. Does everybody know yeah. Bon Jovi? All right, awesome. So anybody ever, has anybody not heard the song Living on a Prayer? I think almost everybody has if you turn on the radio. So he has a song called Living on a Prayer. What happens at the end of the song? What happens in the chorus? He modulates it. He modulates it. So you're listening to it. He's in the chorus and he's like, whoa, living on a prayer. And you're like, man, this is awesome. I'm so uplifted. I don't think I could get any more uplifted. And then all of a sudden he goes, whoa, He modulated. He moved the key signal. He basically went from this keynote to this keynote. He went up. He went from like A to B. That's modulation. That's a basic understanding of modulation. So what these pedals, the modulation pedals, is they pitch you. So they modulate you either down or up, like detuning. Detuning is modulation. Choruses are modulation pedal. So it basically takes your signal and it sharpens or flattens it. And a lot of the really cool pedals are based off modulation. The organizer, which we'll get to, pitch bay, which is just totally, obviously, the, 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 the dictionary definition of modulation. Uh, my, the Ar uh, Arpanoid is, um, the C Machine is, the Afterneath, um, you'll see the Rainbow Machine. I mean, it's all these things that are just about pitching your note somewhere, modulating it. So that's why I call, we call it modulation pedals.